Here's how to reset the control center on your iPhone. Now, if you've upgraded to iOS 18, you have complete control on customizing that control center, but maybe you wanted to go back to the factory default. I'll show you how to do that, but first hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now let's swipe down from the bottom right or from the top right, I mean, and we can tap anywhere on here and it brings up the ability to customize this. Now on here, of course, I can move things around if I wanted to. I can make them bigger or smaller just by tapping on that little, basically, corner at the bottom right. And I can always remove things or tap add control. But there's no option directly in here just to go back to the reset. You can basically see I can customize it, but if I wanted to just go back to how it is by default, I need to hop into the settings. So open up settings here, and then we'll just scroll down until we get to control center right under camera and tap on that. Now, the cool thing is you can just hit reset control center, just like that. It says this will reset your control center layout to the factory default. Now, if I swipe uh, down from the top right here, you'll be able to see this is the default. It has the multiple different pages, what's playing currently on Apple Music or Spotify, your Wi-Fi, contacts, all of those different things. Basically, it is back to the normal default layout. And on here, basically, you can customize it again if you want to customize the look and feel of it after the fact. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.